Six species in the genus Homo have already gone extinct. That leaves one species in the genus Homo, Homo sapiens, our species, that is still around. It's called an extant species as opposed to extinct species. I'm going to go through the history of all seven species of the genus Homo. I'm going to rely on my notes to do that. The first species in the genus Homo, which evolved from prior species, uh, a prior species of great ape, was the species Homo habilis. Homo habilis came into being about two and a half million years ago and persisted until about one and a half million years ago. It was the first species in the genus Homo, Homo habilis, the second species, which maybe was not a distinct species. It's still unclear at this point whether Homo georgicus was a species distinct from other species of Homo. If it was, then Homo georgicus was around 1.8 million years ago, coincident with the extinction of Homo habilis, and was around for an unknown amount of time. And then, as with Homo habilis, it went extinct. Next up comes Homo ergaster. Homo ergaster arose about 1.9 million years ago and went extinct about 1.3 million years ago, persisting only about 600,000 years, approximately twice as long as we have persisted so far, Homo sapiens. Er, Homo ergaster may or may not have been distinct from Homo erectus, the next species, species I'm going to talk about. If it was distinct, then Homo ergaster went extinct about 1.3 million years ago, thereby joining the tree, two previous species of Homo that had gone extinct as well. So now I've discussed three different species in the genus Homo, all of which have gone extinct. Along comes Homo erectus, the upright human, about 1.8 million years ago, and it persisted until about 100,000 years ago, so it overlapped with the current species of Homo still on the planet, Homo sapiens. And then about 100,000 years ago, Homo erectus went extinct. You might be seeing a pattern here. Next up, Homo heidelbergensis, which was around during the Middle Pleistocene, about 700,000 to about 300,000 years ago. It persisted only about 400,000 years, and then it went extinct. Finally, along comes Neanderthalensis. Homo neanderthalensis, the Neanderthals, came into being about 450,000 years ago and met its demise some 40,000 years ago. Spent a long time on the planet with our current species, Homo sapiens, and then it went extinct. Here we are, Homo sapiens, the only extant species in the genus Homo. We've been here about 300,000 years, and we were coincident with the latter three species in the genus Homo. Homo erectus, Homo heidelbergensis, and Homo neanderthalensis. As the seventh species in the genus Homo, our species too will go extinct. And it appears it will happen faster or with a shorter lifespan as a species than any of the prior six species in the genus Homo to have gone extinct. So here we are at the edge of extinction where only love remains.